any time. Uh, anybody have a, a testimony they'd like to come up and share uh, this Sunday morning and what the Lord's been doing in your life, in your heart? I'd like for you to come up to the microphone here if there's something the Lord's working in your life and in your heart. Anybody, a testimony this morning? Sandy's, Sandy's going to... <laughs> um, it's not really a testimony but I just wanted to add what Kevin was saying about um, that song and it really brought me to tears but um, it's not only the witnessing is the door is closing here and we are free to share and free to tell anybody, but that day and that door is closing. So I just wanted to encourage everybody to just, I'm thankful for the jobs I have because I get to share, but that day is closing. You know, and in fact, I was sharing with somebody the other day at work and I thought, you know what, I could see them coming in and just firing me right now. You know, I can see it and it, it might not be now, but it might be later, but um, you know, take advantage of our freedom we have here in America, and I'm so thankful for that freedom that we have, and, not, and I don't take it lightly. Thanks, Sandy. Uh, the Lord has put each one of you in a different place, a workplace around different people, and like she said, the door's closing for that freedom and stuff that you can see that we have, and even the door closing as to the opportunity that we have to continue to share the gospel and that we're looking to the rapture and the Lord coming and then we won't, we won't anyway be a part of that, the church, that witnessing after that. But uh, take every advantage that we can. The people are perishing around us, aren't they? And remember, uh, I'm trying to think of which one of the Old Testament uh, men it was. I wanted to say that it was Jeremiah, but I could be wrong that if he didn't take the word to the people, their blood was upon him. That he needed, he knew the message, he knew the truth, and his duty and his, that what God wanted him to do is take the message to other people. Otherwise, they're going to hell, their blood be upon us for not, ta not taking the gospel message to them. Some of you have to correct me if I was wrong with Jeremiah, but I believe I want to say that it was... Shelley said Ezekiel, so it could very well be Ezekiel. Um, the Ezekiel, they're my, usually, she'll come back and let us know. Anybody else have another a testimony this morning they would like to share? Like to come forward and share? Anybody? Shannon, come on. I just want to give thanks for... Um just what God's done, not just in Lee and I's life over the last 15 years, but other people that are really special to us on our anniversary. Um, you know, we were blessed. We had some gifts that encouraged us to go to Billings and just spend time together and and go out to eat and you know just have a lot of time with each other and not planning family things. So that was really a blessing. But we had an opportunity to take the best man from our wedding out and uh, we spent three hours with him and his wife um, just dining and visiting and um, what I was reflecting even that night I was just listening to him and watching him and Lee talk and just thinking wow we have come miles <laughs> from how we behaved or the conversation that we had you know, on the night before our wedding or on our wedding night. And um, the Lord has, you know, saved Lee and saved Jim, our best man from our wedding since then, and brought Jim through a lot of, a lot of hardships with his family. And um, he's remarried and they have Christ as the center of their life. And he's rebuilding relationships with his family. And you know, for Lee and I, I think I feel sometimes like we're in this protected bubble with our church family that, you know, we're like, we are cared for and we're growing. But just to see, you know, that God's working everywhere. It isn't just right here. And so that was a really a blessing to me on our anniversary this year. Praise God for it.
Amen. Can't say it any better than that. That was pretty good. Pretty good. Anybody else have a testimony this morning they'd like to share? Okay, we're going to 